Ladies and gentlemen, how are we today? Look at Curtis, he's in his crap outfit. Uh, yeah, I did the video once, I was still in my suit, and uh, the video made all kinds of noise, and I'm having to reshoot it, and I've already put my comfortable clothes on. But anyways, it's a real life with a hair system. Um, today's video is going to be about an actual just review on Hair Direct's Clear Bond. Welcome to the channel, welcome to the hair experience. What we talk about here is everything hair system and hair replacement related. Everything with a life with it and how to how to have a good life with it. So anyway, subscribe to the channel, super important to this guy. I still feel like crap, so if you hear me and I sound like I'm short of breath, I am. I don't know what my deal is. I can't get over this lung infection. Oh well, we're doing the videos. Today's review is gonna be on Hair Direct's Clear Adhesive. Now, I did a little mini review, a three day review on this like two months ago, I think. And I didn't give it rave reviews. Now, I was using it with a, um, a uh, lace system at the time, and I just don't think I was very good at applying it or using it. Um, didn't, didn't really know how to use it all that well. Understand that this is not an endorsed video. No one's paid me for this product. I ordered this, I paid for it, and that's just it, okay? Straight up honest review about the product. Um, I like it, I do, um, and I'll tell you why. White bonds in the heat will turn white, and I'm gonna have people in the comments I know tell me, Curtis, you're doing it wrong, or you're doing something wrong. Well, I don't know how else to do it right. Um, I've talked to the, the manufacturers, I've done everything that I can. I've told you guys before that I've used white bonds. I like white bonds, I do, but um, I was using a white bond with a uh, lace system, and those two seem to go together pretty good. Um, when I had, I have a poly system on right now, um, the ultra thin skin, super thin skin poly on right now, um, with this and tape around the perimeter. Um, but this is just going to be a review about this stuff today. Um, it's good. I like it. Um, it applies. It's very stringy. It smells strong. Um, if you can see if the camera, I mean this is, it, well, I guess it's not gonna do it now. Um, it turns very stringy, but I mean if that's, and it gets on the shaft, like the shaft of it, you can probably see those strings hanging there. It gets on the shaft of the, that holds the brush, and then it wants to run down the shaft so it's kind of, you really need to pay attention. Let it drain and then kind of wipe it off and then kind of spin it and then go with it. So you just have to pay close attention to where it goes or where it is on the stalk so it just doesn't start running down your face or on the counter or whatever. It's messy stuff. But I mean, you got to take the bad with the good, right? So it doesn't turn white. The heat really doesn't affect it all that much. It doesn't seem like. Will it? Yes, but I think it takes an awful lot. Um, with the thin skin or a skin system, I think this is the ticket, guys. This and a, uh, a tape around the perimeter. Just got to be careful on a super thin skin because I have torn this one and this one's worn out anyways. So, um, so anyways, back, back to this. Um, I apply two coats. It doesn't really tell you. It says apply thin layers to non-lace surface and scalp. Let dry five to seven minutes between layers. Position hair. Press down. Contains ethyl acetate, keep away from heat, avoid eye contact. If any sensitive areas, any sensitivity occurs, stop use, keep out of reach of children. Um, so I apply two layers. The first layer I leave on for four to five minutes, I guess, and I let it dry. And then I put my second layer on, and they're super thin layers. Um, but the brush just really isn't all that great to do it. I mean, I guess it's all right. Uh, but it doesn't apply like a white bond. It's not as easy as a white bond. So I apply it, you know, and I only do that front two inch area of my hairline anyways, so it's really not that hard. Um, I do the five minutes, I wait five minutes or seven minutes-ish on that last second coat, and then I apply the unit. Um, it works good. Um, you will use more of this product than you will a white bond. Um, I don't know, it's just, it's, it's 1.2 ounces. Um, it says a one to two week hold time. It will only hold for seven days. That's all I've gotten out of it. Could you get more if you were probably less active than me in an office environment? More than likely, yeah, you could probably get 10 days out of it. 
I use it with a scalp protector, with a Walker scalp protector, the ultra thick or the thick scalp protector, and it seems to work really well together for my body chemistry. Everyone's going to react different with the chemical. Um, I didn't get any headaches. I didn't get any anything weird with the chemical. Ethyl acetate is is the FDA says it's it's okay for human use. Um, there's no FDA approval or anything like that on the bottle, but I've been using it now for going on about five weeks and I haven't had any issues with any negative reaction. Um, if you use a product on your skin, I think it says that it's like 14 seconds before it's in your bloodstream. Um, so I would think if I were to get something like a headache or anything weird were to happen, I would, would know it rather quickly. Um, I haven't gotten any feedback from Hair Direct uh, specifically about this product with uh, asking any questions about the ethyl acetate. I just didn't bother calling um, and I used it hoping for the best. I tried it on my hand first overnight to make sure that it didn't turn into a rash or anything crazy. And my nose is still running, sorry. And uh, it, nothing happened. It seemed fine. So I gave it a whirl and, and I like it with the thin skin, but with the lace, I, I didn't like it. Um, so, I mean, that, that's really what I got. It's definitely worth a try. I don't think it's that expensive. I think it was like 16 bucks or something like that, which is reasonable. Um, and if you add shipping to it, it makes it expensive, but it is what it is. So, so that's what I got, guys. I like the product. It's a good product. It's messy. Um, but it's something that you can learn to work with. It's like using clear bond. It's no different. You have to learn how to use it. You have to learn how to use this stuff, too. That's what I got. Sorry, I kind of feel like crap today. It's probably a short video, but but I had to get it out there. So anyways, guys, you know I'm always looking out for you. Um, and subscribe. It's super important to me. And uh, let me know if you got any questions in the comments, and we'll answer them. Thank you.